Nama de Patre, Espiritu Sectum. The uh, any cubic mono X is dead. <laughs> So yesterday, went to do a print on it, it had been working absolutely fine, no problems at all. It's been producing some really good and reliable prints. But yesterday I pressed the old print button on it and uh, the, the Z axis moved up and down, absolutely no problems. And that still does move up and down. But as you can hear, there's no fan sound. Just have a listen to this. No fan sound whatsoever. Uh, let's just do a quick test. As you can see, something clearly not right, and then it just reboots. I think it's um, the motherboard that's gone. Either way, uh, with three months old, this is going back for a refund, and I'm not sure whether I'm going to get another one or whether I'm going to get something else. So it's here I need your help and your expertise. What do I do? It's going back for a £350 refund. Do I buy another one? Do I just jump in and think, do you know what? This was a dodgy one, maybe. Uh, let's get another one. Or do I go for something else? Maybe the Elegoo Saturn 2 or something completely different. Um, leave a little comment in the section where YouTube allows you to leave a little comment and tell me what you think I should do based on what you've got and your experience. Um, my thoughts on the Anycubic Mono X were dodgy at the start. It redeemed itself well and has been working for the last three months flawlessly, I've got to say. But now it is uh, it is soon to be uh, no more. It's going back to the, uh, the place from whence it came. So let me know what you think, Greedy 3Ders. Make sure you subscribe so you can follow what's going on here. And I, I want to know as well, have you had any problems with your my any cubic mono x have you had failures have you had anything like this i mean the fans were noisy but now the fans ain't making no noise so uh, let me know what you think uh, see you next time on greedy 3d and stay tuned let's see what we do about the problem